Hey guys, it's Tara. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just going to run through my very first Shein haul. Check out all this amazing nail art stuff that I grabbed for around 40 doll hairs. All right, guys, I took everything out of the packaging already, so I don't have to dig around with that. I've got my window open. It's a little warm here in mid-Michigan today. So you may hear motorcycles. You may hear my neighbor's ducks across the road. I don't know. Country life. You'll hear country life. Maybe you can hear the crickets right outside the window. Anyway, I got everything out of the packaging. Y'all, I got a ton of stuff for literally $40 and I think 13 cents. 40 bucks. That's it. Okay, I'm going to start off by blaming this entire haul on Aggie. If you follow Unpolished by Aggie here on the Tube of Views. She uh, posted a Shein haul a couple weeks ago. And she had, it wasn't this exact one, but she had a e-file bit holder that she purchased from Shein. I went to Shein's website. Obviously, I've known Shein has been in existence for years now, but I never, I have never been to their website. So I downloaded the app. I went out there and I did a search for uh, nail bit holders, whatever the heck they are. Again, Aggie got a bigger one. It has like a cleaning um, apparatus where you can clean your stuff. I didn't really need all that, but as, as of right now, actually for the last few years, I have all my uh, bits in different whatevers. And I'm like, no, I want them all contained in one, one little itty bitty. So that's going to be cute. And I think it's short enough, stubby enough that it'll fit. Yes, for sure. It'll fit in my Helmer drawer where I keep all my, all my stuff. So I was really excited about that, but I think, uh, I think they just send you a random color. I didn't choose pink. I don't like pink. Any boobs. I got that. I just picked up these, um, this set of five. I don't know. They don't really look like perfect quality brushes, but honestly, if you're dealing with gels, doing nail art, you cannot have too many brushes. Am I right? Am I right? Speaking of that, uh, these, I bought a six. These six of them all came together. Uh, like long, longish liner brushes. These are more like detail detail brushes. So I'm going to give those a whirl and then, oh, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Look at these gorgeous babies. So these are three different lengths. Actually, these two kind of look the same length. I don't know. I'm not taking them out, but you know, they were so gorgeous. And again, I bought all this stuff for 40 bucks and I want to say this was the most expensive item in my shopping cart. Hey, motorcycle people. And I think they were three bucks. So literally the most expensive item that I got was $3, but I couldn't pass these up. And another thing, it, another cool thing about Shein, it was my first time ordering from them. So I had a 15% off. They gave me a 15% off code, which brought, you know, my $2 item down to like a dollar and change. I got these, these are just 10 little, you know, y'all have seen these. I don't do gems and bling and all that floofy stuff, but I do use glitters. And I also think these would work perfectly for water decals. So I'll use them for glitters, I'll use them for water decals. I don't know, I don't think I'll ever need 10 of them in my life, but hey, I got them. Uh, these nail wipes, I, G Money brought some of these when she came to visit me last month. Oh, what's this? Oh, uh, I had never tried these before. I've been for years, I've been on the hunt for the perfect lint-free wipes and we'll get to some in just a little bit. But she brought these and I, they have holes in them, of course. So I don't use these for uh, like wiping off, you know, tacky layers and that kind of stuff because there's holes in them. But I do like to just throw a couple on my desk and use them, uh, they work really well to clean off my brushes when I'm working with gels. So I went ahead and got my own, my own little packy pack of these nail wipes. Of course, they will not go back in here. And speaking of nail wipes, oh, uh, okay. So I saw these, again, I spent hours down this nail art rabbit hole. I saw these, hang on. Pardon the ASMR. 
I saw these. There were a, a roll, it looks like a toilet paper roll. Uh, they're a roll of 300, but they were only $2. They um, uh, instantly reminded me of my young nails, lint-free wipes. These are truly the first lint-free wipes that I've ever found, and I have tried dozens. Uh, they're, now, these on um, Young Nails website, I think, are around $8, 8 or $9. You get 500 but for two, two bucks, uh, I get 300 They are super similar, not the same. Similar, not the same. But anyway, I'm gonna give them a try. See if they are truly lint-free. And we'll go from there. And if they are, if I love them, they are really soft. Uh, maybe I'll go stock up. Maybe I'll stock up. So before I carry on, I forgot to, to tell y'all, or I wanted to show y'all, what I am wearing. Uh, my nails are looking a bit raggedy because I spent all night last night in the clubhouse mixing polish for my anniversary event, which starts on Friday, August the 19th. But y'all, I made, <laughs> if y'all follow um, G Money, Guileen325, of course, y'all know, <clears throat> pardon me, her grandson Lucas is obsessed with dinosaurs and his two favorite colors are green and rainbow. So, of course, I had to create a custom for him that is obviously uh, dino green, but has a lot of gold shift in it. And it is loaded with linear hollow pigment. Uh, this is only two coats. Stay tuned to her channel. Stay tuned to my channel. I'm going to swatch this for you guys. It is stunning. It will also be available on the 19th as part of my anniversary event. Uh, six years, y'all. Basis Loaded Lacquer has been in business six years. So pick up a bottle of Lucasaurus on the 19th. I'm going to be doing small batch polishes, which are just what they sound like. Polishes that are mixed in very small batches. I may have three bottles of something. I may have six or seven bottles of something. And most of them will not return. So they are very, they will be very limited edition. Y'all, I had the attic fan on and freaking bugs, freaking bugs coming in here. Anyway, I just wanted to give y'all a quick little, uh, what is on my nails. Lucasaurus, Lucasaurus, he loves it. Thanks G-Money for letting me create our sweet little Lucas, his own custom polish. All right, back to the Shein haul. Another thing I loved about shopping from the Shein app is uh, they ate, well, first of all, I ordered on August the 4th. It's now August the 12th. So it literally only took eight days to get here. All this stuff showed up today. And you can track your package. I did have one item missing. So through the app, I was able to contact them and let them know. So these are just your alcohol, uh, you know, your aluminum with the little alcohol soaky pads. <clears throat> Pardon me, y'all, my allergies are killing me. I think, yeah, I think there are only 50 in here. But, you know, again, wasn't, wasn't a big deal. I'm gonna give them a try. And they're so inexpensive. If I love them, I will go back for more. I got this little container. It's just a little container. But I have so much stuff like, you know, every time you order some nail kit or something, you get free stuff. You know, they just, if I had a dollar for every one of these that I've owned. Um, and then also like brushes, maybe I can store my brushes in here. And this obviously will fit in my Helmer drawer. Again, I think it was just a random color that they send you. Once again, I'm not crazy about pink, but here we are. And it's fine. I want to say it's probably about, I don't know, seven or eight inches. Maybe nine. Maybe nine inches. But it's perfect. I think most of my brushes would fit in here. And I also got this. Now, this arrived... <laughs> It is way smaller than I thought it was going to be. Uh, it's hard to judge. And maybe I didn't, obviously I didn't read the description. Um, but it's just a little container, you know, a little snap-on. I mean, this is smaller than like a pill organizer, y'all. It's tiny. I have no clue what I would store in here. But I now own it. I now own it. 
So let me put that over here. Oh, you guys, nail foils. Oh, I'm obsessed with foils. Obsessed with foils. Um, how does it come off? Okay. These are gorgeous. These, I want to say were just like a floral. And I'll, I'll link all my stuff, uh, all my, if I can find them. I'll try to link as much stuff in the description box. This one is, I think was just a floral. I can't find the damn opening. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Now it's stuck to me. Gorge, 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 gorge. Transparent background. So I got this one, uh, 10, 10 folds, 10 different folds in here. And I think they're all transparent. I'm not gonna unroll all these, but yeah, I think they're all transparent. Oh wait. Is this one solid? Nope, that's transparent too. Okay, so I wanna say this one is just like a multi <clears throat> floral set, but then I also got this one, and this one has to do with butterflies, I think. But again, tons of flowers on here. Absolutely loved. There's some text on here, I guess. What is this? This says, this says gorgeous. And this says gorgeous, that says beautiful. So again, transparent. How do I get my finger stuck in these? Uh, transparent, beautiful, beautiful. Nana saw this and of course she went crazy and she's already picked out. Uh, I can't remember which one it said. Oh, this one, <clears throat> yeah. Nana went crazy for this. She wants me to do a coral put a coral back on her nails and then do this one as an accent. This one does not, well, there are a little bit of open spaces in here for transparency purposes, but it's pretty solid. So yeah, you would want a color, a base color under that for sure. But these are beautiful, absolutely stunning. Little birds, this is different, I like that. So, folds. Fools, I'm obsessed. Obsessed with the fools. <laughs> now, oh, oh, I got this. Yeah, it's just a little, uh, cause you know, I'm a queen, honey, I'm a queen. And it just keeps your, uh, you know, your brushes from rolling around. Rolling around on, on your desk, on your desktop. It's just a little brush holder. Again, I think it was like a dollar and change. Two bucks, thanks, Shein. And they did have several different uh, little styles and stuff. Anyway, soup's cute. Nana, of course, snatched it up and tried to put it on her head. So now let's jump into sort of like my nail embellishments. I, I saw these, y'all. These are massive. I had no idea that these were gonna be so big, but here we are. So, and I think this is just stuck, yeah. These are huge. I mean, they're stickers, by the, by the way, they're stickers. Uh, but maybe I could just cut, I don't know, cut, I don't know. But they're huge, but they're blue and they're flowers. Holy crap, there's a ton. Oh boy. Anyway, look at all these. Man, yeah, I wish they were smaller. <laughs> okay, so if you see these on Shein's website, um, I bypass them for nail art purposes. I mean, unless you want to chop them, chop them up. Ooh, look at this gorgeous, that gorgeous turquoise rose. Love you. All right, so that was kind of a bust, but I don't know. Maybe I can find. Maybe I'll put one on my Mac. I have a bunch of stickers on my MacBook. Any boobs. So I was really bummed that those will not work. <laughs> for nails. Oh, okay. So I kind of went a little crazy. Kind of went a little crazy with, and I kind of thought these were dried flowers uh, for like encapsulating in gel or acrylic or whatever. And I don't use acrylic, but they're not, they're like paper, kind of like little cardboard, little cardboard guys. So let me, uh, let me zoom in here. <laughs> But they're adorbs, and there are a bunch of different style flowers. Uh, there's some 
daisies and some roses and some leaves. I love that little green leaf right there. Love, love, love. Um, I have a million trillion stamping plates, of course, and y'all know that I am obsessed with florals and vines and leaves and trees and nature, but I really enjoy... Okay, so this uh, this was one item, and then I bought these four separately, but I really enjoy... And so, of course, I can stamp. I can stamp any freaking image I want, but these already have all the detail and stuff in them and different... Oh, hello. And... Uh, different colors. Yeah, sorry, that fell in my lap. So these are, oh, okay, Tara, just stop touching them. Girl, calm down. Love them. Love them. Love. So this is sort of like a purple, purple mix, floral mix. Love that. This one, ooh, this one's like tropically, tropically, a tropical mix. Well, I thought I saw a little high. Yeah, well, it's not a hibiscus. Anyway, love big, um, what are those, banana leaves? I don't know. Beautiful. And they kind of have like a little shimmer. A little shimmer to them. Love that one. This is like a pink, pink roses. Oh, look at that. That has like some, did I see? Yeah, like little hollow. Oh, look, hey, okay, I didn't know that. That's beautimus. Love, love, love. Reminds me of Mimi. My Mimi could grow roses like out of concrete. I don't, I can't grow roses to save my life. But I got these for Nana for her um, Nana's Island Escape when she goes to the Bahamas. Oh, sweet Lord. Anyway, it is. <laughs> Way to go. It's just like little underwater, I don't know, animals. There's like some little corals. Some shells, some, um, uh, what are those called? Oh, look at her, a little mermaid trying to jump right out. Oh boy, oh, a little seahorse. So these are really cute. I'll probably put a couple of those on Nana, encapsulate those with gel, gel for her trip to the Bahamas. And then the rest of these are either stickers or water decals. But this came in a two sheet. Some of them were only like single sheets, some are two. I think one's 25, but anyway, more freaking leaves, vines, flowers. I'm obsessed with these, like this whole color palette situation going on. Love that. This was a set of three. Y'all, they're literally all flowers. Oh, I can't help myself. So that's like a blue purple, sort of like a pinky orange. Corley, sitch, and then some greenery. Greenery going on. And I'm filming this haul just so I can get all this crap put away. These are also stickers, but this was just a single, a single sheet. Beautiful. Love, love, love. This was a two, uh, two sheets, double, double sheets. They're different. Love that. And this very like minimalistic black and white and red situation back to life with you natural back to life these super cute there's two they're the exact same but they're just like um tulips i love tulips can't grow them out here either because the critters eat them they eat my bulbs uh, here are two, two more. Yes, you you see a theme. You see my obsession. My obsession is on display. Love these, love. And they are, um, you know, if I have to trim some, cut them or whatever. But for the most part, I think they'll fit. Definitely, love, love, love. And then this is a twenty-five pack, and these are water decals, and they give you the instructions on the back. I thought they were stickers. Couldn't remember. I would have figured it out, obviously, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> why did I, why did I order these? Tara, why did you order these? I can't figure it out. I don't know. More flowers. Gorgeous. Kella lilies are my favorite. Beautiful. Beautiful. They're all different. 
And I think I have a, and I can't, I don't know how to pronounce this, Haranuta. Um, they used to be a brand that uh, Born Pretty sold or whatever, or may, maybe part of the Born Pretty family. But I have a couple of stamping plates from them, I think. These are interesting, probably ones I would never wear because that's really not my jammy jam. Cute, cute, love. Okay, obsessed with the fruits. These are really pretty. What is that? Lavender or coneflower? Hmm, don't know. <laughs> Gorgeous, right up my alley. I also love these. I kind of wish they were a little bigger, but I guess I could do multiple ones, um, you know, on a nail. Those are interesting, a little retro vibey, very minimalistic. Okay, so this one was kind of odd to me. Hang on, I think it was this one because I don't know if you can see this white stuff. So I don't know if that glows in the dark. Usually glow in the dark has like a green tint to it and I am wearing a freaking like day glow green tank top of course, but I'm not really seeing any sort of like glow in the darky, I don't know, pigment, something back there. Uh, these are just like little tips and I, I had to get in really close. They're, I was like, what the heck is that? They're owls, owls, wolves, rabbits, cute. Get some constellations going on. This is a little uh, really interesting. Love, 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 love that one. Oh, mm. another one of my faves. I freaking love. I'm just obsessed with little tiny flowers. Those are really pretty too. Those are interesting. Oh, th there's another one. See, see all these little white things. Um, yeah, in the background. So maybe they do glow in the dark. I'll have to check that out later. And this one, like these are just white. I don't know. I don't understand. Well, I'll let y'all know. I'll let y'all know if they glow in the dark. And again, more weird like white stuff going on in the background. But those are interesting. Uh, these, I would totally not my jam. Okay. And that, that's really pretty. Okay, guys, that's pretty much everything from my very first Shein haul. I uh, am really excited. I'm impressed by all of these things. Can't wait to jump in and start using them. Again, I did have one sheet of stickers or decals or something that was missing um, from my order. <laughs> am I going to miss it? No, no, I'm not. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And be on the lookout for <laughs> lots of floral manicures <laughs> on my channel. So anyway, I will see you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.